G'day beautiful people, I'm Chookly and I'm super excited to be finally making my first real Minecraft video. A big shout out to all my family, the Chooks, and to all the flexi kids around Australia. All you guys have inspired me to follow my passions. Those passions being family, Minecraft and Australiana. So, first let me explain the lingo. Lingo means language in Australian slang and I will be using a lot of it. Anyways, this is my mansion. This is me, Chookly, and my two chicks. <laughs> this is the main bed I sleep in. It's just handy. Over here, I have... Oh, sorry. I continued the main steps right up to the rooftop. Well, not rooftop, but the top, top level. Uh, yeah. I'm not so good at getting through doors. I've got these guys working for me. Hmm. Hmm. And I made a cactus farm. Goes right down there. <laughs> I didn't realise before there was a hidden there was a hidden room back here. And the golems kept spawning because there were spiders and creepers and all sorts in there. So that's why there's ended up being so many iron golems in here. Hopefully they're still not spawning any more in, but we shall see. Got cats. All my villagers from the mansion have disappeared, I think because of raids, which were very annoying. I have got upsies and downsies there. Uh, this is my spider spawner naturally occurring up, up there in the mansion. You can hear them. I'm not getting them today. And unfortunately I wanted to record yesterday and managed to accidentally start a raid. We got rid of the raid but look what the Ravager has done to my trees. All of my trees were manicured, actually not like that one, like this one. Manicured, topiary trees. Beautiful. I actually just fixed these couple up, but I've run out of birch leaves to fix the rest. I've had a shocker. So, I'm on a mission to collect... <laughs> to collect some more birch leaves. I've been working a little bit on landscaping but I'm still, this is my landscaping chest here, still working that one out a bit. Um, and since the second raid, I've had a few different raids on the mansion, since the second raid, there's another kid up there, where are they running to? Oh, crazy. Um, yeah, I think I've lost my really, really, really good archery. I'll show you my archery range. There's my sheep farm over here. That little, that little shed is for the shepherds there. Uh, this is, we've got, oh, he's new. He's a, he's a novice. He's just a newbie. Not so helpful. So, practice your archery. This is where you go. Oh, I'm just going to put all my armour on and get my archery out here. Yeah, you can practice. Hey. <laughs> I could be a little bit better at this too. <laughs> there we go. And luckily these don't set the place on fire, but they are a little bit hard to reach, which is a pain. So I'm just going to get scaffolding. I've got a bit of random all different things in my my kit at the moment. There we go. Okay. So I'm hoping. I'm really hoping because he does not accept string. I get a lot of string from my spider spawner, so I really want string to be a thing. And I'm a poet, and I didn't even know it. And if I did it, I probably wouldn't do it. This. I just like how the sugar cane looks around this pond, but 
but it's handy to make a few emeralds with my with my villagers. So I'll just step back here. You can see the mansion a bit more. I've got a kelp farm here. Uh, this is my little Juliet balcony, which I quite like. And pig farm there, obviously. I've surrounded the place with bamboo on this side, and this has got fences because the chooks, uh, not the chooks, sheep. The sheep are over there, so that's it. This is my waterfall I created. Still needs a little bit of something more, I think, but I've started. And this is pathway, which I still need to do more as well. To go into the pathway. He ended up in there because he was chasing me accidentally one day. Well, he wasn't accidentally chasing me. He knew what he was doing. So I've got lots of <laughs> librarians. He's a good one. A bit expensive, but um, it's my church. I just wanted a little Italian style chapel in here. Uh, I've got the librarians like it in here. Not the priests, surprisingly, but you know. I, I've made quite a few librarians <laughs> trying to get all my things that I want. This is where they sleep. Well, these guys must be spawning up here. And yeah, I've got a downstairs as well, so. Yeah, they like it. This is going down pretty raw down here. This was when I first first found my mansion. I made a um, mine, mine shaft right there to help me out there. I don't think I've lost any villages down the mine shaft, but yeah, it's possible. It's possible. For a while I just had too many spawning everywhere. It was crazy. Um, yeah, this is this is my tunnel. Did I go through the tunnel? I didn't go through. I'll show you the tunnel. So it's still got a bit of work to do on the tunnel as well. I wanted a pond in here. just seemed appropriate. And shall we go for a ride? Let's go for a ride. Go, 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 go. <gasps> Except the sun's setting. Oh, well, that's alright. So, bye! See yous! Got masons. That's a mason's hut over there. Making the, making the stone work for me. And I'm going to have to get to a bed pretty soon. The yucky ones are going to start spawning. Eventually this little desert bit here is going to be a succulent garden. And I'm going to put a few more houses in here. Ooh, I haven't looked at my volcano at night before. Uh, that's my volcano. I don't have a bed. Do I have a bed on me? No, I don't even have a bed on me. Okay, we're just going to keep travelling in the dark, hoping that nothing gets me. We're going over to the other village. My first village that I... I think I need to do a bit of work on my railway. <sighs> um, yeah. So my other village is just over here where the savannah is. I'm going to build the homesteads going up there and it's got a bit of bush out the back I'm making the Australian bush out the back there oh we're so close but now it's fully night time come on get there get there <gasps> spider okay just get my sword out here because this is not good and I'm just gonna jump out and run Oh, but I actually need a spade to get through here. So this is my very rough... Oops. I can hear a zombie. And I don't have enough. Oh my gosh. Oh, run. Spider. I'm just going to kick you out of bed. Sorry, man. 
Sorry, man. I need a bed. Whew. That was scary. Okay. So, I should also have this because there's probably some scaries around somewhere. No? We made it in time. Yay! Okay. Um, creep hole. Very sad. Okay. This is a pretty ordinary looking village. It was just where I got my villagers. Oh, there's a spider. We'll get him. Um, this is just where I got my villagers from to take to the mansion. First up. Oh, I've still got my arachnid. You are goner. I still have my bane of arthropods sword on me, which was meant to stay with. Hello. Do you want some chicken? Have a chook. Have some chook. So in Australia we call chickens chooks. You can have barbecue chook. You can have chooks in the backyard like I do. Like most of my family does. <laughs> um, but I like the word chook for me in Minecraft because in Minecraft I am a chicken. I'm quite scared of lots of things. Oh, you just killed something up there. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm a big chicken when it comes to Minecraft. Have a big confession to make. I've been playing Minecraft for a few years now, and the end of last year was the first year that I felt brave enough to go into the nether. So, I actually got pushed into the nether by somebody, but we won't go giving names away. Even the sounds of this freak me out. Okay, I just, I just, I just have to put, oh, that's totally the wrong button. I have to put my sounds down because I just, it's scary. It's just too scary. Okay, I'm feeling brave. I'm actually very happy with my nether now. So, oh, it still sounds too loud. Um, <laughs> so, I've put this, I've moved portals around, so I feel very clever for moving portals around. There's a blaze spawner up there. I have had a go at making this a blaze, a blaze farm, but they just don't want to come down. It's a bit of a problem. But I have spawn proofed all of this. This is half slabs down here and glass on the side. So that's pretty good. And the blazers have escaped. That's okay. They're not going to affect me. I can hear a ghast somewhere, but I'm okay. Yeah, over that way. It is pretty funny. So I actually have a blaze spawner in here as well which is much easier to get to. This portal goes to my mansion. So I'm quite happy with that. I'm going to see. This is my cheaty way to make a blaze spawner. Oh, no one's blazing. No one's jumping out there yet. So we just wait until a few. I'll show you how that works. Wait for a few to... No one's, I'll show you the rest of the place while that gets started. So, just so happens, luckily enough, that I found underneath where my first portals were is a nether fortress. I haven't actually found anything good in this nether fortress yet. I started exploring a little bit, but like I said, Chook is a good name for me because I'm a bit of a chicken and it gets a bit scary out here. Very scary, in fact. Yeah, the nether's a scary place. Can't wait for the nether, nether update though. 1.16, yay! Don't know when it's released. going to be released. Probably later in the year, I guess. Let's see if I have any ghasts spawn in the... Not ghasts. Oh, please. Hello. No one's here yet. 
That's surprising. Okay. Maybe I just have to stand here for a few minutes. I need to be... Is it 16 blocks away? Something like that. Yep, so I haven't really done anything different to this place here other than put the slabs down and the, and the glass. But it's quite nice. I feel secure. And if we go down this way, I'm going to go a bit faster. We don't want to get too bored. Head down this way. And it's sort of a bit of the end of the road here. One day I was feeling brave and I did venture up these steps. But um, I'm not overly brave with this scary, scary, scary place. So, yeah. I was hoping to continue on, but I don't know how that's going to happen. Anyways, I'll see if Blaze Spawner's working yet. Also need to eat some chicken. Nom 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 nom. Oh, there's a couple of ghasts around. You can see on the bottom right hand corner of my screen I have subtitles there. It makes it a lot easier to find direction of things. Let's see if we have any. Ah, uh, is my blaze spawner broke? Is it broke? Let's head back to the mansion. Okay. Sometimes I get pigmen come out. I gotta work on my doors. <laughs> they just get in my way. All right, I have a mini chook farm here. They're pretty good at escaping my chickens, just like my real chickens. Escapees. This is my AFK fish farm. Beep, beep. And out here. So when I first started, the railway went up over the trees came right up onto this rooftop, right to here, and that's how I got my first couple of villages in here. To take over the mansion, <gasps> I broke the roof. Broke the roof here, I broke the roof here, I ran out of glass here, <laughs> and yeah, that's, that's how we got the thing. The spider spawn is in this hidden room, so I dug down underneath, to, and put water at the bottom for so the spiders come down to the hoppers at the front. Oh, this is my Juliet balcony. I quite like this. It's cute. Got a good view. So you can see the half that I started to landscape. I've actually only cleared this bit lately. My my pumpkin patch was here, and I've moved it over here and oh, tripled that size probably uh, we can go down down to bubbly that's is this the, this is the up isn't it yeah that's the up it helps if I go down the down and let's see if I can not get I didn't get burnt yay it always gets me okay so oh so what have I got down here uh, I did have this was my this was a cooking room. I had um, furnaces all around, but I've moved them out. I've still got some jails hiding in here, which is probably not too helpful. I had a go at making a sugarcane farm, automatic sugarcane farm. Haven't quite got things right there, but I've ended up with enough sugarcane for the time being not to overly worry about it. Big thing, storage storage is an issue so this is the naturally forming naturally forming storage room in mansions to start off like this with just this size chests but um, some of them I've doubled up here these chests go sideways so they're bigger large chests up there's just a little chest 
So, oh, how are my riches looking? I, I'm going pretty well. I'm going pretty well. But, oh, and it's night time. Okay, so let's go fast up the stairs and fast again. Yeah. So, uh, this is barbecue area. Oop. Yay for barbecues. Love a good barbecue. Got lots of barbecue chook there. So that's the rundown of my mansion. Oh, I didn't quite show you the pumpkin farm. That's where I was headed. Pumpkins are now here. Got a little 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 stream at the back there. Creek. We call them a creek in Australia. We've got a little creek going here. Pumpkins growing all around. Yeah. So next next episode I'm gonna have some more oak leaves, perch leaves, sorry, birch leaves. Fix up my topiary over there and we should do something with this area. Hmm, I have to think about it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hooroo!